So welcome back to another Inventor tutorial. Uh, this tutorial is going to be on the pack and go function. Uh, this allows us to take our full assembly with all the sub assemblies and bolted connections and uh, content center, pack it all up into one zip file so that we can email or upload to a cloud service uh, so that other people can download it and view it at a later date. So let's jump on in and see where we end up. So I've jumped straight on into a uh, an assembly. So I've got my assembly here, and as you can see in the tree on the left hand side, we've got lots of uh, parts and sub assemblies, and uh, we've got lots of content center, and actually there's um, some design accelerators in here. So we want to pack and go this so that we can upload a zip file. So if we uh, go over to File and then Save As and select the pack and go option. We might get a couple of little pop-ups, so I'm just going to click OK for those. Uh, and we should get this uh, pack and go pop-up. Uh, we want to change our options from copy to single path to we want it to select the keep folder hierarchy. And we want to make sure that we're including our linked files. And we also want to package as a zip as well. Uh, we then need to select our destination folder. So all I'm going to do is in my uh, in my just a camera rolls empty. So I'm going to make a new folder and I'm going to call it uh, Martin Task Two. Um, I'll then select that folder um, and then I'll click OK. And we want to make sure that our name and the task is in there or student number and task is in uh, is the title of this folder. So I'm going to click OK. I'm then going to now uh, in, under the find reference files, click the search now button. And we should have down the bottom here files found a whole bunch of files. And uh, and then what we can do is we can then click the start button, which will start to pack everything up and uh, put it into that folder uh, Martin task 2. So I'll click start and it'll take a second or two and then once uh, once it's complete and the, the done button is active we can select done uh, and now what I'll do is I'll show you in in my actual uh, file explorer so if I come over and in my camera roll we have two uh, folders one is the the uh, packaged up folder just on its own and the other one is the actual zip uh, and we want to upload the zip. Um, now if I just quickly click into this folder you'll see that actually it contains a, a, a lot of data. The most important bit is under the work groups folder we've then got not in project folder and you should be able to then find all of the files that you've used in your and the parts that you've used in your assembly, including any of the design accelerators, content center parts, whatever they are. Um, so the, the zip file is the one you want to up upload, um, making sure that it's got clearly which task it is and who's done it. Um, and that will then that should then work when I download it uh, and unzip it and I can then see everything. So hopefully that's been useful to you. Uh, and I'll see you again for another Inventor tutorial.